here's what I want you to do. I want to, to try something special. I want you to try to read my mind. Okay? And I'm going to have everybody try to read my mind. What? What'd you say? Come on. I said, I said I'd like you to try to read my mind. What'd you say? You were reading my mind? You were? Can you read my mind right now? <laughs> you see, the Canadians, they're not like us Americans. <laughs> All right, we got a lot of the same stores in, uh, in America as they do in Canada, except uh, they're much bigger in Canada. We got bigger malls, we got bigger everything there. We got a bigger country than us. So we're going to try to read my, I want you to read my mind. And, uh, and Jody, uh, who are you here with? Anybody special? There's 12 of you, okay? And how, how do you know each other? What? BC Farm Women's Network, right? What, what is that? Your Farmer Women's, it's a Farm Women's Network. Uh huh. Oh, there you go. Okay, I understand. It's not a problem. Now, I'm going to give you a background of myself. I'm going to try to read my mind right now. You got it? <laughs> You've had a pre show cocktail. <laughs> All right, I want you to try to read my mind. Let me tell you my interests, my backgrounds. Uh, I like sports, uh, I like exercising, uh, I obviously like magic, I like cars, uh, I like shopping, uh, I like buying nice stuff for my wife. And, and I live in Ohio. You got it? Okay, good. Here's what I want you to do. Before I got on the ship, on Sunday, I actually came in the day before on Saturday. So before I left, on Friday, <clears throat> I went to the store. The last store I went to in Ohio, I want you to read my mind right now. Okay? And I give $1,000 to anybody who can read my mind on the spot. And just concentrate. Got it? Where was I shopping? in Akron, Ohio, the day before I left. Jody, right? You're number one. I will put this. I will number one. And I'll leave it right there. Okay. Jody, where was I shopping before I left home in Akron, Ohio? Go. Walmart. <laughs> other pants in Walmart. <laughs> You're close. It was Sears. It was Sears, but she doesn't want any money to give her a nice round of applause. <laughs> All right, Jody, now that you got my interest, <laughs> it's my attention, throw that rock over this way. We're going to try to find somebody in the middle of the audience there. Boom. Whack. Hi, sir. How are you? Rock roll right off your hand. You're sitting next to a beautiful woman right there. She's wearing chartreuse. What a nice color. Hi, what's your name? Bernadine, where are you from? Bernadine from Chicago, Midwest. Hi, people. <laughs> Bernadine, what I want you to do is tell me what I got where I went shopping. This here, you bet? I give you a lot of clues, right? Something a guy would buy. That's all I'm going to take. Bernadine, you're number two. I want you to concentrate. I think you'll get this if you really concentrate. There you go. And remember, remember to Bernadine, Bernadette. Bernadine, all right, there you go. All right. What did I get at Sears before I left home? Go. Right. Something nice for my wife. She'd be happy to see me come home. And it would be what? An outfit? <laughs> I'm thinking just the opposite right now. But... <laughs> <laughs> She's really happy to see me home. Uh, any, any special kind of outfit? 
or lingerie. I wasn't aware they had lingerie at Sears. Do <laughs> they? Oh, all right, you're close. I bought a drill. <laughs> That's one of the flaws of Bernadine. You didn't get the top of the All right. Okay, throw that sucker over to the end. I'm trying to find somebody near the end. So just a uh, boom. Who lands right there? Oh, you. Hand that to the hooker. Hand it to her. Perfect. There you go. Hi, how are you? How you doing? You, uh, uh, let me just tell you something. Have you noticed that this whole mind raping just ain't working out? Huh? Yeah, you notice, yeah. All right, well, I'll tell you what. We're going to try something different, me and you. What's your name? Elizabeth? <laughs> really? <laughs> all right. I got a bunch of uh, sale tags here, and you women all know what those are. Sale tags, a bunch of prices. There's uh, about 40 of them in here, and they're all different. All different kinds of prices are in there. And what I want you to do, Elizabeth, is reach inside, close your eyes, and reach inside this bag, and just pick one up, one tag only. Keep it in your hand. Only one tag. Don't look at it. Make sure you only got. Mix them up. Make sure you got one tag and one tag only in your hand. You got it? Only one. Can I have a rock back? All right. Nice round of applause for Elizabeth. Elizabeth, there we go. I want you to concentrate on that price that you picked, and I will see if I can read your mind instead. Okay. <sighs> You've heard all the talk we've been doing. Is this a good price or a bad price? Just give me a clue. Good price, bad price, medium, you don't know. It's a good price for whatever I got. You know what I got. <sighs> I don't think it's a great price, but I'll tell you what. I'll drop a zero. I'll see what I can do. This for you. This is number three, right? Okay. Easy for me. There we go. Please give these people a nice round of applause before we run out. I'll tell you what. I'm going to go back in time. I got these little envelopes that I, I drew little numbers on, and and, uh, and we're going to see if we were to actually go back in time uh, and, and see if things were different. We'll see if that can happen. All right. Now this was Jody, right? Hi, Judy. All right. Judy, uh, you know where I went. All right. All right. But you said I went where? Walmart. Okay. If this went back in time and I was actually able to think what she was thinking and know what she was thinking, I would have written down on the card W A L M A. Oh, that's nothing. One out of three is nothing. And I'll prove it. Number two, Bernadine, how are you? Bernadine, I went to, where I went? I went to Sears, I bought a drill. Apparently, I, uh, I went to Walmart, and what did I get? <laughs> you know, don't you? Hey, you know what? You just take it off the hand. What the heck's the difference in what you pay? I bought a drill, but I was thinking you, Bernadine. I actually wrote, forgive the spelling, I wrote lingerie. That's weird. That's strange, isn't it? Elizabeth, how are you? All right, it's down to you. You're number three. Give or take, no matter what I bought, you pick the price. So you're the one. You're the deciding factor. Whether I get applause, whether I just stop the chair right now and go home. It's up to you. You pick the price. What was the price that you picked? Do you want me to tell you, or you want to tell me? You want me to tell you. And you'll be honest. All right, I trust you. I wrote... $39. What do you got? That's it! Okay. All right, please give these ladies a big round of applause. They have no idea what's happening. But we're having fun now. It's my favorite.